Good morning, Laguna Woods. It's Monday again, and it's going to be Music Monday. And you say, Rick, why are you wearing a cowboy hat? Because these are my friends over here, and we're going to have some country music again today. And uh, I love it so much. Of course, that's what I listen to on my radio anyway. I don't know if you knew that. But anyway... Uh, we are going to start with a verse, and it says, Jesus is speaking, and he says, Greater love has no one than this, than he lay down his life for his friends. And you are my friends. And that was John, John uh, 15 at verse 14. And so I just really uh, am so thankful that I can call Jesus my friend. He's my Savior, but he also wants... Us. He wants a family that loves him and, and that can call him friend. We have the Gospel Hour. The Gospel Hour Band. The Gospel Hour Band is back, and we're now on the pier. I love it out here. It's nice. It's nice. What are you guys going to sing for us today? Well, this is the deal. Some of our best loved hymns were written out of times of great sadness. And this song that we're going to sing was written back in 1855. This young lad, Joseph Scriven, wrote this song. Actually, he didn't write it as a song. He wrote this to his mother. He wrote this letter to his mother. Because you see, he had immigrated from Dublin, Ireland over to Canada, and he was engaged to be married. And shortly before his wedding, his wife tragically drowned. He was sad, but then he realized his mother was sad back in Dublin. So he wrote this letter to her. She later put it, the letter away in her drawer. And after she died, and after Joseph died, somebody found the letter and turned it into a song. Back in 1855. <laughs> Kim, when you come up, I mean, it's just amazing how God preserved that, turns it into, because music speaks to the heart. And I'm just so thankful. So, what's the name of it again? Oh, what a friend we have in yeah. Jesus. And boy, is it good Here for we us go. today. Jesus yeah. is my best friend, and I can attain to these guys. These guys are Jesus lovers. You can call us Jesus freaks if you want, because <laughs> we are. And it goes like this. What a friend we have in Jesus. All our sins and griefs to bear. What a privilege to carry everything God in prayer. Oh, what peace we often forbear. Oh, what needless pain we bear. All because we do not carry everything to God in prayer. All man knows. What take it to the Lord in prayer? Can we find a friend so faithful who will all our sorrows share? Well, Jesus knows our every weakness. Take it to the Lord in prayer. Hey, harmonica. verse, but that's okay, because sometimes you need to know that verse again. <laughs> Here we go. Do your friends despise, forsake 
you Well, take it to the Lord in prayer In his arms he'll take and shield you And we'll find a solace there Oh, what peace we often forfeit Oh, what needless thing we bear Oh, because we do not carry Everything to God in prayer All because All because we do not carry Everything to God in prayer Amen! <laughs> oh, I love that so I love that so much! If I stand here, it's like I'm a part of the group. You are uh, a part no, of I'm not. Even though I have the hat I now, I got boys for Christ. I got boys for Christ. Yeah. Oh, we have too much fun. But you know, I I used to struggle a little bit with that song because I just when I I I, I was uncomfortable with calling Jesus my friend, only because he's God, right. and so in awe of him and. And so that made it a little hard. But over the years, I've been able to take that part of it because the Bible says Jesus wants to be our friend. So I, it's not up to me to argue with that. But, uh, but I've always loved the second part of that, which is really, it's repeated many times in that. Take it to the Lord in prayer. I, I don't know how many times I've seen it, but don't you think that is just an amazing uh, admonition for us all? Take it to the Lord in prayer. I tell that to my kids all the time. And they look at me like, Mom, you're weird. <laughs> I'll yeah. Out of my yeah, yeah, yeah. So, folks, there's a lot in that song. Do you have another song that uh, handy? Sure. What or do you got? What do you got? I don't know. You don't want us to close out in this? I don't know. Okay. Well, you can. <laughs> you like we have been doing that. So anyway, well folks, this has been a great few days of I hope you've enjoyed all these music Mondays that the band has given us. And uh thank you each and every one. I don't want to stand in front of Pat here. But uh yeah, close us out with that because friends, I don't know if you're struggling with anything today, but Jesus is your friend, and he asks you to, you know, prayer is just talking with him. So it's nothing fancy. You just take it to Jesus in prayer. That's right, and this is all you need to know. Amen. What a friend we have in Jesus. All our sins and griefs to bear. What a privilege to carry. Everything to God in prayer. Oh, what peace we often forfeit, oh, what needless pain we bear, all because we do not carry everything to God in prayer. Have we trials and temptations? Is there trouble anywhere? We should never get discouraged. Well, take it to the Lord in prayer. Can we find a friend so faithful who will all our sorrow share? Well, Jesus knows our every weakness. Well, take it to the Lord in prayer. Harmonica. Take it to the Lord in prayer. Do we 
your friends his spies forsake you will take it to the Lord in prayer in his arms and take and shield you and you will find him solace there yeah. Yeehaw! Woo. I love this day. <laughs> well, well we gotta have another day so like this.